You're listening to Daily Manor Devotional. Thanks for stopping by on this beautiful Wednesday morning. Uh, or if you're listening to this at some other time, then welcome to you as well, since YouTube lives on. I guess you could be listening to this on any day. The title of today's devotion is Wariness. If you like this devotion at any point in time, feel free to hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Comment uh, if you wish to. You can always send me prayer requests. The email address is dailymanamedia at gmail.com. And uh, you, can, you can also put prayer requests in the comments and whatnot. Just, just whatever you want to do. Help out the old YouTube algorithm if you see fit uh, to spread the word to more believers and non-believers as well. If you're listening to this and you're not a Christian, don't know what it means to be saved or anything that I'm talking about, it just sounds like a bunch of gobbledygook, then shoot me an email and I'll be happy to talk to you about it. Thanks for for listening. And uh, like I said, the title of today's devotion is Wariness. Uh, What can help me when I'm wary or discouraged? Is it weary or wary? I don't know why that word seems strange to me. I'm going to go with weary (laughs) or discouraged god's response how we thank god who gives us victory over sin and death through jesus christ our lord so my dear brothers and sisters be strong and steady always enthusiastic about the lord's work for you know that nothing you do for the lord is ever useless first corinthians 15 57 through 58 happy are those who are strong in the lord who set their minds on a pilgrimage to jerusalem when they walk through the valley of weeping It will become a place of refreshing springs where pools of blessing collect after the rains. They will continue to grow stronger and each of them will appear before God in Jerusalem. Psalms 84, 5-7 Occasionally you need refreshment to renew your soul, your mind, and your body. Refreshment comes from spending time alone with God in prayer, reading His Word, listening for His voice, and reflecting on your blessings. Refreshment comes by disciplining yourself to get enough sleep and to eat well. And it comes from fellowship with other believers who are encouragers rather than complainers. Follow this prescription and you will have a new outlook outlook on life. God's promise. Don't get tired of doing what is good. Don't get discouraged and give up. For we will reap a harvest of blessing at the appropriate time. Galatians 6, 9. This devotion comes out of Four Men, a devotional by... Tyndale. Thanks for listening. Have a fantastic day. God bless.